spots. Uh, just being in the right spot, I think they've all been they've been pretty good. I think um, I think they're starting to get it, um, starting to understand how how hard they have to play, and uh, I think it's showing on the court. I know you're not a big man, but. What type of things do the coaches usually harp on these big guys about? Running. Running is the main thing. Uh, you know, if you run, you get easy baskets, and that's, uh, that's been his, his main thing. And then uh, post defense, especially. Um, just uh, try not to foul a lot in the post. Um, that's really it. Those, those are the two main things. When Coach Smart went to Texas, did you think about going there too, or was that just you wanted to stay? Ah, right no, <laughs> I really didn't. I, mean, I really didn't give no thought into it. I, don't, I knew I didn't want to go that far away from home. So. When um, the last couple of games, you guys had to go small a lot. So today you had more traditional UNC type lineup. How much of a point of emphasis was it to get the young bigs involved, especially as soon as they got in? Uh, you know, it's, it's it's coach's biggest biggest point of emphasis. I think is having two bigs out there. I mean, he doesn't really want to go small. Uh, we've done it because it's worked a little bit, and uh, they're still getting used to the, the college game. So, I mean, he's he's used it a little bit when we needed to, but he wants to go uh, he wants to go two bigs as much as possible. And, and if they play the way that they play t today, I mean, we can. We can stick with that. And today was an opportunity to get them involved and maybe get some some, some confidence out of them, some, some quality play, because against some of the bigger lines, maybe they struggled a little bit more. So when you see what they've been able to produce against that kind of opponent today, you think that's something they can build on? Oh, yeah, I think, on? I think I think they can build on it especially because, um, you know, a lot of this game, uh, especially in your freshman year, is about confidence and, and uh, they see that they can play here, they can they can uh, make an impact, and uh, hopefully they can they can see that and, and build on it from here. Kenny, I was talking to Ash Roy about the 2015 class of uh, you and Luke. Neither of you guys were considering top 100. I think it's the lowest signed class that he's had here. Yet here you are starting and obviously playing very well. Is, is that something with you guys being roommates? Was a talking point at any point? Not really. We haven't talked about it. Uh, Cause you know, once you get here, all that stuff goes out the window. Whether you're number one, or whether you're number one hundred, uh, you still have to produce once you get here. Um, so we don't really, we haven't really talked about the rankings or anything like that. Um, you pay attention to the rankings.